Now let's bring in now former president of the Victorian Liberal Party, Michael Kroger, and former federal Labor MP, Michael Danby. Welcome to you both. Great to see you. Now, I've just Sorry. spoken about how Andrew Giles has been soft on border security for years. He's from the left faction of the Labor Party. He's argued against immigration detention. Michael Danby, I want to start with you. You are, of course, in federal Labor. You're from the right faction of the Labor Party. Should a socialist left faction figure be running our immigration portfolio? Well, Elbow's made the judgment that Giles is responsible. Uh, I, I feel sorry for Andrew. Uh, he, he clearly isn't up to it. I mean, it's a mis mistaken priority to focus on the voice when you've got all of these potential criminals. And he would have known it long before you or me, Sherry, that there were all these murderers and sexual offenders. He should have known how many ankle bracelets were being distributed, how these people were being handled, what offences they've recommitted. Uh, and uh, uh, it all stems from their ideology. I, I commend you for doing what the ABC never does and talking about political differences in the Labor Party. They're absolutely germane to Andrew mm. Giles's case and to the way he handles things. Well, they, they're, you know, so important because you look at the New South Wales Premier, Chris Minns, he's a centrist or, or right of the Labor Party, he's been sensible, he, he's been a true leader um, since October 7, for example, but then you look at the Prime Minister who is on the far left of the party. Um, Michael, you know, you have key figures of the Labor left, Prime Minister, Foreign Minister, Immigration Minister. Michael Croker, how do you think this is shaping our country? Well, it's not, it's not good. I mean, the Labor Party is usually at its best when it's led from the right. Hawke, Keating, uh, Rand, etc., etc. The, the, the Labor Beasley. figures of, of the right who are... Who are uh, Beasley, etc., who, 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 are, who are sensible, centre, they mesh well with our international... Uh, you know, the countries with whom we have great relations, America, Britain, etc. Once you start getting sort of Jeremy Corbyn-type figures, as the British Labor Party did, their versions in Australia, all hell breaks loose. So you've got Penny Wong, who is basically anti-Israel as the foreign minister. You've got Giles, who luckily for him is in the social left, so Albo won't sack him. Uh, no matter how bad he is. You've got Albo, who's in the socialist left. You've got Plebisek, who's in the socialist left. Mm. And, uh, you know, the mainstream Labor figures like Shorten, etc., are on the outer. So it's not going to go well for Labor. And every day you see these major issues being debated, you start to realise this is not the government we thought we were voting for. We didn't think we were voting for this type of extreme position in relation to mm. Refugees, or the extreme position Wong's taking in relation to Israel. Yeah, because so we were end, never told it'll end about badly it. Badly for them. We were never told about it before the election. They took a small target agenda, Correct. and that's not what we've seen.